In today's video, I'm gonna show you 5 quick steps you need to follow right now on your PC in order to get insane performance out of your any PC in Fortnite brand new chapter 5 season 3. So guys, welcome to my channel. If it's your first time here, please subscribe, drop a like on this video. And with the single time, let's dive straight into our this video. So guys, in the very first step, we are going to create a FPS boost profile in our performance monitor. So for that, go for your window search, search for performance, and you will find a performance monitor option. Now, right click here and make sure to run this as administrator for having the full access. Once you go out here, now you need to go for this data, click the set, and click here on this drop down menu. Now you need to go for user defined, and now simply right click here, go for new, and click on the data collector set. Now you simply name it like FPS Boost. Now you need to go for create manual and advanced settings. Click next, check mark on performance counter. Now again, click on the next button, click add. And guys find out here processors option now select out here processor from this list and after that now find out here the highest number available in this list so now simply scroll down and find out here the highest number available in this list click on this add button and add this counter inside this list so now you need to simply scroll down and there you will find our process option simply go for it click on the total button click on the add button and also add the process into this counter tab now hit ok click next next and simply click on the finish button and save the fps boost settings on your pc now the next step you need to disable the core isolation or memory integrity on your pc simply go for your window search search for core and you will find our core isolation system settings go inside it and there you will find our memory integrity simply guys turn off the settings because this helps a lot of people for improving their pc performance for gaming you can also turn it off and on and experiment which works best for you mostly by turning off the settings most of people get more performance so guys i suggest you to turn off the settings and close out your window settings now in the next step we are going to disable all the unnecessary service from our pc so guys for that go for your window search search for services and make sure to also run this as administrator for having the full access in the service tab now once you get here now you need to press w from your keyboard and there you will find out valid service i'm not using any service of the valid so therefore you need to go into the properties and make sure to disable the settings on your pc now hit apply and click ok once you're done now you need to scroll all the way down and there you will find out this windows insider service so guys again go into the properties of the service go for the drop down and set it on disable and hit apply and click ok and disable this useless unnecessary service from your pc once you're done now you need to scroll all the way down and there you will find that xbox game service so guys make sure to disable all the service on your pc like xbox accessory management i have already disabled it xbox live attendee manager also disable it xbox live game sale disable it and at the end xbox live networking service also disable it on your pc once you disable all the service from your pc now simply close out the service tab now in the next step you need to open up epic games launcher on your pc now go straight into the library and find out here your fortnite now you need to go for three dots and open up this manage option inside you will find that verify game button I suggest you to verify your game one time because this will fix all the stutters and missing or corrupted file of your Fortnite and automatically fix that. After that, now scroll down, go for launch option and make sure to turn it on. And you need to use here this command that is minus plan play for reducing or optimizing your network in Fortnite, minus no splash, minus no texture streaming, and minus use all available cores of your CPU. Therefore, you can get maximum performance out of it. Now, once you use here this command, by the way, you can find this command in the description of my video. Simply copy and paste here this command. After that, now close out it. Now, the final and the last step, we are going to optimize our Windows power plane settings. So, for that, go for your Windows search, search for power, and you will find out here, choose a power plane your control panel setting so open up power option inside you will find that all the available power plan of your pc by default you will find out here the high performance power plan and i also suggest to use the high performance power plan for having the more and higher fps while gaming so guys after that now you need to go for change plan settings and open up change advanced power settings now inside here you need to go for hard disk click on the drop down now go for turn off hard disk and set it on zero minute after that scroll down now you need to go for processor power management click on the expand go for minimum and maximum processor state and set all the settings on 100 percent after that hit apply click ok and close out your power settings now you need to one time reset your pc there for all the changes take effect after that launch your fortnite and enjoy the best performance out of it i hope you love it please make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel and see you again in the next video